Let's talk about market control. Let's talk about oligarchs. Let's talk about imperialism and a modern day phenomenon called kleptocracy. Let's do that. When you have multinational corporations that are sitting on trillions of dollars in cash reserves, that's blood flow that is stopped. And my definition of currency and money is it is the lifeblood of any economy or society. So when you have multinational corporations that collude with senators to create laws and you have commercial leaders and governance leaders sitting on multiple boards, what you end up with is a bird's eye view of how to control the markets. So if you control markets law and currency flow, you can control entire populations. So do I think that kleptocracy is a is, is controlling our society? You damn right I do. Am I worried that we can't put an end to it? No, I'm not worried because we we're the United States of America and we are the people that have proven when our constitution was originated that we can stand up against tyranny and it's time to recognize tyranny it's called kleptocracy and it's time to defeat it with good law like we did back in the day ethical project development and ethical bill writing and that's what you're going to find as the basis of my platform. So I, I essentially just told you my platform. Public enemy number one is kleptocracy. It's global public enemy number one. How do we manage our country? Well, we must put bill writing in the hands of the people. Bill writing is going to take place in every community in this country. People are going to have to get used to coming up with ideas, doing the work to create these bills, get them perfected so by the time we get them to the legislators, they're already very well known by the people and very much approved by the people. And they're very short and concise and they're not 700 pages. They're not filled with all kinds of deals for kleptocrats contracting buddies to steal your tax money. <laughs> Elitists, beware. You're, you're, it's over. <laughs> you guys are so stupid. You, you abused all of these great systems because you thought the people were so stupid that you could get away with trillion dollar heists and COVID relief and and now you're trying to take the tax money for uh, trillion, two trillion dollars to build an infrastructure program. No, you're not going to get away with that anymore. Nope, Dave's here. Dave represents we the people working. <laughs>